Okay, I've been curious if PLA, just standard PLA from eSun. Um, I think PLA is all about the same. If it'll burn, and how easy it burns. Um, it's not so temperamental to heat as um, ABS and there's a few others. So this is my scrap pile. And then I got a few pieces of trash in there, but I didn't feel like sorting it all out. All my mess ups and stuff. I'm only doing PLA right now, so I know all this is PLA. So I was going to see how easy it is to light what color it puts off because plastic puts off black when it burns so does rubber so i was just gonna light this on the ground here and see what happens see how easy it is to light it is a bit windy today Let's see what it does it lit as easy as a piece of cardboard Slowly burning there. As easy as that was to light, I don't really need to test it much more. It kind of burns, kind of lit like cardboard. It won't really stay lit. Let's see if I can, uh... no, it's still burning. Really hard to see, but it is burning. Let's see if it burns the catches that next piece on fire. I think it will, and it is turned into goo over there. Not quite burning like normal plastic. Normal plastic turns into a liquid. We'll see once it burns that whole thing. Smells just like plastic burning. Pretty slow burning. The wind ain't really affecting it, but super slow. Don't know where it's all going when it's burning. It's almost burning like wood where it kind of just turns to ash or disappears. Because the yellow isn't doing much. So now we got the fire coming from underneath. It is so slow at burning. I could almost make a fire stick. <laughs> fire stick. A uh, fire starter. I could see about 20 minutes out of this. 
and this isn't a compressed material. I don't know if I even have anything compressed. That's, well, that's a little bit compressed. That's about all I got for scrap. It's kind of compressed there. It's, I think that was a zero infill, so it's really not even compressed. Yeah, I don't have like big blocks or anything. See how long that would burn. Most of this is just scrap supports. Okay, I would say it burns. Lights just like cardboard. Doesn't light like paper. Paper kind of, when you light it, it burns super quick and up the side of it. I'd say this is super slow. If it didn't put off an odor, it'd be really nice. Especially for a fire brick, fire starter.
Okay. Didn't quite take 20 minutes. It's starting to die down now. I'm going to see how flexible it is. Yeah, it's just as flexible as normal plastic. The remnants. It's a... Uh, oh, it didn't burn at all. Still a bit of gray there. So it turns into like... Crap. Just like uh, normal plastic. It doesn't burn as quick as plastic, but it um, the aftermath of it is the same. It turns into like this gooey glue kind of thing, and it smells like garbage when it's burning. Yeah, PLA will burn. We'll do one on ABS next. Right there's our PLA by Esun. About an hour after I lit it on fire. This is all I have for scrap for uh, ABS plastic from Esun. It's just the normal black. Um, yeah, I don't mess up as much with ABS. I got it pretty dialed in. My PLA, uh, that really wasn't a mess up. It was uh, just the supports. Uh, ABS, I normally try to not use any supports. This was my tower I printed. Got a video on it printing. Let's see if this stuff burns. I'm gonna put it right next to it. Just gonna light the top on fire. I don't have enough to really do a good test. And it's windy outside. I'm like, this is the day to do it because it's supposed to rain for the next eight days. Just gonna light it. Let it put itself out. Okay. It burns black. Also, uh, if you guys watch my PLA video, it didn't burn black. ABS is burning black. Yeah, you guys can see that black. Oh, it's burning quick, too. That PLA took a long time to burn, but this ain't taking no time at all. Let's put that close enough so it lights it. Can't believe there's such a difference in it. I know there's a difference in uh, how well it lasts and the temperatures it can take and all that, but for burning, I thought it was going to be the same, and it's not. Again, that's what it looked like after PLA burnt. It's like a mat of glue. Let's see if it lights that second tower on fire. I did have to leave it on there a little bit longer, but I really think that was just because of the wind. Flames a bit higher. I can feel the heat off of it too. The PLA just kind of burnt slow. There, it's lighting that second one on fire. Um, I'm not getting an odor off of it like the PLA. PLA s smelled just like trash when it was burning. Yeah, I'm taking in the, the black smoke. Just see if it smells. Uh, it's a very light odor. I say it's only a quarter of the smell. It still smells like trash burning, but it doesn't, um, it's very hard to get the smell. brought out my tripod the black is just like burning tires I don't know if you guys can see how much blacks coming off that not that I'd have a lot of ABS to burn. I'd have to burn it at night. <laughs> Ooh, 
Looks like it's going to turn down into a goo, just like normal plastic, which is good. Because when I make stuff um, with the 3D printer, I want it to be as good as something I bought in the store. And every time I do something, it just seems like it's not as fine finished. Of course it won't be, unless I sand it and paint it and all that. But uh, when it burns down and it looks just like something I could burn in the store and it would burn down the same. It makes me feel like I'm maybe using the same plastic that China uses. Curious if this is going to turn into ash or it's just going to turn into a blob when it's done. Look like gum. I think it's going to look like gum. Still burning, but I can't really see anything there other than the pieces that look like gum. I take it back to the now that the wind has died down, I'm getting facefuls of the black smoke. It's it's just as strong as the PLA. It's an awful smell. I can't stand burning trash. The smell of it, I'll burn trash. <laughs> Now the other one, PLA is made out of corn starch or something like that. Corn, something with the corn. Don't know what ABS is made out of. I just know it can handle a lot higher temps for heat. It's also oil resistant. I don't know if it's coolant resistant out of a car. To me that's chemical. Um, it's a lot different. It's turning into nothing. Oh, and the wind blew it out. Well, that's what it looks like. It, oh, that smells so awful when it blew out. Oh, man. I gotta get away. I don't know what that smell is. It is not the burning smell of trash. Put my thing over me. Um, where is it at? Where is it at? It's right there. That's what it looks like after it burnt. Wind blew it out. Where's my stick? Stick to move it around. That turned into goo. It's not dry yet. Or it's not cooled off yet. I would say it would have went down to nothing if the wind didn't blow it out. But what's the chances of it getting that small in the wind not blowing it out? I'd say that burns better than this because this is a bunch of goo. It's a big platform of goo. So I'd rather this burn than PLA. Except this burns slower, so if you built like a whole house out of PLA, your house would burn slower. Thanks for watching, and ABS will burn and smell awful.